21. Okay, it says suppose the demand and supply of a monthly gym membership are given as QD equals 600 minus 10P and QS equals 300, uh, 10P minus 300. So we've been told to determine the equilibrium price and quantity. So as always, step one, you have to equate QD and QS, QD and QS. Okay, so we're going to say 600 minus 10P. equals 10p minus 300. So basically, we're trying to find the value of the market price, which is p. So uh, we're going to do algebra, grouping like terms together. So we'll say 600 plus 300 equals 10p plus 10p, all right, okay, so 600 plus 300, that's 900, equals to 10p plus 10p is 20p, right? So to find the value of p, we're just going to divide both sides by 20, so p is going to be equal to 900 divided by 20. Okay. And 900 divided by 20 gives us 45 quadra. That's the equilibrium price. This is what people are paying for their membership, and this is the amount also the gym is receiving. Okay, so after we find the equilibrium price, we want to find the equilibrium quantity. Okay. So to do that, we're just going to substitute substitute P equals 45 quarter. So with two equation, all right, you can say this is equation one. This is equation two. So we can substitute P equals 45 quarter into any of these two equations. So let's go with uh, the first equation. Okay, 600 minus 10 P. Okay, so it's a substitute. Uh, P equals 45 quarter into equation one. Okay, into equation one. So that, that is going to be 600 minus 10p, okay, let me substitute p, we'll say 600 minus 10, open brackets, 45, let's so we'll get 450, so it says 600 minus 450, and we get 150 units. Okay, so this is this is the value of QD. Okay, this is the value of QD. Okay, so let me just put it like this: QD. QD. Like that. Okay, and then also here QD. Yes, so that's our equilibrium quantity, 150 units, and that's and that's all that you need to do.